Alright. Day 15, we just busted out of camp. Uh, today could be the most important day of the trip. Climbing Mount San Jacinto. And uh, I got the Netherlands behind us. A girl from Sweden. And uh, up ahead is Lisa from California. So I think it gets up to 9,000. And I may have to do something I hadn't done before, and that's uh, wear some snow equipment. So could be an interesting day I'm trying to do 13 today so probably shouldn't be talking now but uh i'll keep everybody posted on my progress all right a thigh and calf burner climbing up that mountain. I don't even know what the name of that mountain is right there. That's it. But that uh, kicked my behind. Uh, here's the other side. It's just as nice. Uh, so I've got, uh, I'm waiting on Lisa. She's from California. Uh, gonna make a decision here. I think I want to go PCT northbound and not the alternate. But I will wait for them to get up here. I'm gonna look at my maps. We left at 6.50 this morning. Uh, so good time. She is slightly slower than me, so I'm gonna wait for her and then we'll uh, make some kind of call right here. But I think we're going northbound, so. Uh, there's a portion of the mountain we're gonna go. We're not going to the top, but we're going over there. So anyway, that's what I got for now. Uh, I'm probably an hour, hour and a half into it. Again, we're trying to make 13. One thing today is uh, <clears throat> water. From that campground that I was at last night, the next water source was either downhill one mile and then back up one mile or 10 miles up the way. So I elected to, cause I got a full, still got a full bottle of Gatorade and then, uh, um, I'm going to eat snow along the way, uh, and hopefully we'll make 13 miles. we, we got to make 10, though, because we need that water. So, Okay, uh, I'll keep you posted. I don't even want to watch. Okay. Okay. which is uh, an acceptable alternate route. So, I'm gonna go around and meet these people. The one guy that did the snow. It was dicey looking.
we've made it to the actual PCT. Took a little acceptable PCT detour, snow detour. So, uh, I'll be honest with you, I bought those micro spikes, but I could be happy with not using them at all. cruising along uh, way off the mark on time today uh, just because of uh, stuff. Uh, Lisa split off the trail um, bailout trail back to Idlewood so she took it um, we had a little tearful moment up there so I'm kind of hooking up with groups kind of flying solo still so and really settled in on any, any one particular people so uh, anyway still hoping to make that 180 today uh, but it's looking less and less did pack a good deal of food, but I need to get that ready for the water source, so we'll see how it goes. Right now, smooth sailing, as you can see, and flat. I've been climbing. There's some climbs out here that are rough. I think that's, uh, yeah, still Palm Springs, so they're enjoying 70. I'm probably in the 40s up here, so, which I'll take when I'm moving like this. So. Alright everybody, this is the first with spikes. Alright, did my first snow walk and uh, successful, about a 30 yard stretch. Sorry you couldn't see it because uh, I wasn't about to try and film it and walk it. So, anyway, trust me, I made it. No, what? I didn't use one. Micro spikes going back on. All right, uh, eating dinner. I could be at the best camping site on the whole PCT. It's very possible. I'll show you in a little bit, but uh, the fins have just arrived. <laughs> And Ben from Maine, and I've been walking with Craig from Canada. Hello. So that's the crew for today. Um, it was a hard day. So anyway, I'm not going to get up because my food is cooking right now. But I will get up in a little bit and show y'all this campsite. But that's that's just a, a hint of what I've got to show you. Tony, what are you eating tonight? Ramen bomb. Ramen bomb. Uh, Taters? Potatoes, ramen, and then tuna. Oh. Oh. Just like that. It's yeah, amazing. Okay. Do you work in a restaurant? Not yet. <laughs> I'll do a restaurant. <laughs> okay. Let me walk you through the campsite here. So, 
That's one side. Got all these big trees. The moon. Risto. Tony. There's my tent. One on the left. So. <clears throat> And then there's the other side of the camp. <clears throat> Came in off the trail right through there. Then it goes back up there. It was all up today. So let me just tell you something. Uh, eight miles, I think. Yeah, eight something miles today is all we got. So, oh, it was awful. Uh, really worked hard to get here. Um, tough day. Uh, we're spent after doing a 16 yesterday. So, anyway. Uh, we're at mile 175. And uh, hope to do better than that tomorrow, 10 or so. Uh, and then get off this mountain. Because it is, uh, it's a tough slog up here. So, had to do a lot of trees blown down and had a lot of uh, uh, snow. Had to, had to take those uh, spikes, had to put them on and off as you come to snow. So it was difficult, but uh, beautiful place. This is, this is probably the nicest camp site I've ever been in. So, all right, everybody, happy trails.